Hi, this is Christina Hills from the website Creation Workshop. And in this video, I'm going to explain to you how to get a Gravatar. So here I'm at my blog, and let me scroll down and show you what a Gravatar is. When you visit any WordPress blog, you can make a comment, and you will see down below there's a place to leave a comment. When you leave a comment, if you have a Gravatar set up, and I'm going to show you how to do that, then when you make a post on anybody's website on the internet, your image will show up. And you see here Linda doesn't have one. If you don't have one, you get this uh, little mystery man. But if you have one set up, and if the website owner is uh, using, has turned on Gravatars, your image will show up anywhere you post on the internet. So let me show you now where you need to go to get a Gravatar. Okay, well here I am at Gravatar.com and when you go to Gravatar.com it will show you what is a Gravatar. So a Gravatar is any little image you would like to represent you out there on the internet and it's free all you have to do is sign up so you want to click up here in the menu and click on sign up and you want to put in your email address so I'm going to set one up for my assistant okay so as soon as you put in your email address it's going to send you a confirmation email so you just need to go and check your email and confirm that who you are is who you say you are with your email address alright so now you just have to go to your email and you'll see a welcome to Gravatar and to activate your account all you have to do is click on the link below so I'm going to go ahead and click on this link that Gravatar sent me in my email. I'm reading my email. Alright, so what it does is it pops open a new window and I'm going to choose a nickname and I'm going to choose a password. and I'll click on sign up and that username already exists so I will choose another one Denise the VA Alright, so once I've chosen my username and my password, then all I need to do is add my Gravatar image. So I don't have any images yet, so I'm going to upload one from my computer into the Gravatar account. So I'm going to click on this link to add one. Now Gravatar gives you the choice of where you want to get your image from and I'm going to choose my computer's hard drive but if you have your image already on the internet you can select that so now I need to browse my computer and find the image I've selected my image from my hard drive, I click on open 
and then I want to click on next. All right, so now I'm going to crop this at whatever image I want. So I'm going to just move my cursor around with this little box till I get the cropping I like and then I'm going to click on crop and finish. And I need to decide the rating of this and this would be a G rating. Uh, most of the time you're selecting a G rating. Okay, so now when Denise comments on the internet using her email address then her image will automatically show up. You don't need to upload it to the different WordPress website. All you have to do is set up your image inside Gravatar and anywhere you go you will um, your image will show up. Now if you use multiple email addresses you can add a new email address as well. That's it. Again, my name is Christina Hills from the Website Creation Workshop, and I just showed you how to create your Gravatar image.